guys. Today I'm back after a long time from Photoshop Cover TV. So in this video I'll be showing you how to add a thumbnail stage. So let's move ahead. We have an indoor photo shoot. I mean you wanna take your photos in the indoor in your homes or anywhere and you wanna put it out in something backgrounds like that, uh, this one. So, what the basic is, you had to select an important background. This is important. So, how you select it? So, so, make the selection by this uh, quick selection tool or anywhere. Yeah. And how you need uh, By the bracket buttons, you can degree, increase the size of that. So, here it is. Now, just gonna drag this by clicking and clicking. Spit. Once you have made your selection, so this is a detach your selection. Press Q. So to remove this area. Also this. Then, oh my goodness, go ahead into the this refine edges to refine your edges. So click this, and here is the size. You're gonna see. And apply the brush all over to these hairs and almost all the body. So, just like it. Just say, click OK, and here it is. So. I've downloaded an image of the chair basically to get an image of the chair. So there's also an image I have. There is, come on. Oh, she's so. Just drag this person out by the move tool. Uh, sorry, I couldn't show you. So, so the move tool is right here. You're gonna have a sheet. So, after all, there are the chair also here. Go there. So, I'm gonna go, let it go to work on this. So, press the Z to zoom out key. So, then there is a control and T to transfer, or you can go to the edit. Then, uh, Edit, sorry, we edit. Yes, and here is the free transform analogy. So, click that free transform and just uh, add just the size as you want to put it as you put it like this. So, that's it. That's large. So there's a big problem with this picture, it's about the background and the difference of the background of this video. We're basically picking up that portion of this video. So, I have to go down this picture. Down, so. So, so this is perfect now. So, again, press U to get your move to exactly this portion here. And the chair also. We'll take the chair a little bit to that. It looks really good. So, here it is. And just leave it. Just like that. So, now, here's the basic idea. All the way to change there in this picture is... So once you have it done all of this, uh, so now I'm gonna go to the curves by passing Control plus M or going to the adjustment in the images, and here are the curves. I'm gonna go to the curves. So this is a little brighter, and the background is not brighter. So we're gonna unbright this by decreasing the curve level. Oh, sorry. 
We're just gonna do it with a chair. And we're gonna bring on the person. Look at that. It's looking a little bit matching there. You can see the difference there. And again, on the curves, we're gonna go to these. Check it out. These red green on the boo boo. So the red is. Ooh. So what you need to do is check it out on the upside and the downside of the curve where it matches the background so it is matching a little bit upward with the background and I'm going to put the green layer there so the green should be constant a little bit and go to blue So let's just blue. So now it's a it looks a okay. We're gonna cover the other thing later on. So go ahead and you erase it too, and put in that eraser on this. Uh, I mean, uh, this uh, bad side. Uh, there it is. Just don't worry about that. Don't worry. So we're gonna put in the background getting a hat onto the background and then we're gonna go to the filter blur and tilt field layer so this is one of my favorite blur effect we adjust the blur capacity so there it is it looks fine now with blur also Done. Click OK. I'm gonna finish this one. And here it is. We're gonna go to the cropping section. It's too hard of a shoot. So here's the technique that I ever used to cover such kind of uh, difficulties uh, that is brighter between the background. So. Press Control, Alt, Shift, and E together to merge all the layers, and then go to the levels by like pressing Control L or going to the adjustment on the levels here. So, go to the levels and increase both the levels. So here you can see that the image is looking perfect and the good. So guys, thank you for watching my video please subscribe me like it and share it this video and support it to me I didn't have enough subscribers so thank you everyone for supporting me and I have right now almost